Welcome, my name is Daily Fix, and today we are going to be continuing with Distant Stars Universe as the Slukken or the Slukken, whatever. So, um, I've been told that I should look into something called a monitoring station, and, and I would really like to do that throughout this, uh, this episode, because I have nothing that resembles that. Apparently, it will uh, let you know when enemy fleets are popping in and considering we will most likely be at war with this uh, this empire for a number of times in the future i would really like that also if we take this entire space i think we actually managed to spread out quite nicely uh, but before we do that i would like to look into my planets because we have um some planets that have a well not as much as happiness but they're still doing fine they're still happy so that, that, that all that's all that matters right so i'm going to be tinkering around with that a tiny bit which is actually strikingly odd my numbers are done oh there you go so let's put you down to one and i want to see changes in the happiness and this one is still, we're at 50% and 37. Like, what the hell is going on? <laughs> we can go up to 60, probably. Um, it could be the troops that is just offsetting this. Let's put you to 30. You're, you're on 30% as well. So, um, 20%. Did anything change here? Deadly Plague Strikes. Plague does not spread to other colonies. Well, I, I truly hope that it doesn't, indeed. The growth is 3%. So, yeah, we're, we're starting to make a nice amount of money here. And this is all maxed out. Investigate, close, thank you. Uh, 17%. It's fine, it's fine. Holy crap, look at this. Let's go to 20 as well. Um, I agree on... Ending the war. I could really use that because we need to work our fleets way, way better. Let's put you up to 30. You know what? Let, let's just do like 20 if you're in the 30s. You could probably go to 30. And, and we just do this to start making money. And these guys are infected. On our capital planet, how are we going to be dealing with that infection? Let's pause here. Is there a way? Like, do we need to send out a scientist? Or... I do not know how to deal with this. It could be in one of the technologies where... I think it's the high-tech one. The finest medical treatment available. Hmm. Provides unusual medical training. Provides the best physicians. Increasing the population growth rate for every colony in the empire. Wow. I, I should focus on the miracles... Because they bring you a lot. Look at that. Population growth speed plus 100. Colony development plus 20%. And it just costs me 10,000 each year. I should have done... I, I should... Next time we play this, we're going to be focusing a lot more on... On getting like these miracles. Because I think they're absolutely great. Okay, let's close this. So, um, like I said, I would like to go and look into bases. Okay, oh, otherwise, the, oh, something else made was very, very clear to me. Our spaceports are way too weak. And, and we've seen, we've seen the spaceports of our enemies. And, and they were 13,000 in terms of um, defensive capabilities. And, and we don't even have lasers on these. You're on point blank. I want you to go on all weapons. Why are you on point blank? Let's save you. Um, you keep going in upgrade mode. I don't like that. So you have a mark 7. Fine. Let us go with category and name. 
We are going to be placing a lot of these additional weapons on these. Maybe I'll just go with category, category, because all of the weapons should be at the bottom part. Oh, it's size. This is not category, it's size. See, amount. Okay, well, I'll go with name then. Point blank, we have 10. We got 30 of these blasters. How many of these missiles do we actually have? 40. Okay, so how much would it cost... To add a lot of weapons. And, and I'm saying a crap ton of them. I would like to add 30 up to those. We add max 30 max blasters, which is fine. Real guns. Did we add real guns? There you go. Oh, and of course, now someone is barking. Okay, so we're back and we are definitely increasing <laughs> the firepower of this uh, of this station. It's going to be huge. Look at how much uh, fuel we need to be adding. That is sane. I I insane. It's not sane. It's insane. Okay, let's see. Where are you? Fusion reactors. We, we, we really need to increase those. Oh boy. That is very expensive. Look at the maintenance. I'm not sure if this is a good idea. <laughs> yeah, I might be um, a bit late figuring that one out. It is extremely expensive. Hmm. And we have five of them. If, if this, the cost is like 10,000, 10, and how much that did it cost? Seven. Actually, it's it's only a 3k increase. It isn't that bad. It's not good either. Let me be honest about that. It's definitely not good. Uh, and I kind of want to go with, with 30 shields. And we're going to be adding a bunch more armor. How many armor actually do we have? Like 35. I would like to go like to 50. Like 900. I think that's a, a gorgeous number. All weapons have been set up. Okay, so here we go at it again. Let us go to these. Let's add 10 because we know we're probably going to be around that number. Okay, real guns. 30. Uh, we got 30 blasters. 30 face cannons. And we add 20 more point defense. And we have more than enough missiles. Uh, every time we'll get more. And we could also... Do, by the way, do we have spiders on here, right? Yes, we do. Oh, I kind of like that. What I would like to be doing is increasing the habitability as well. Since we have... How much? 21. Well, that is not bad. That is definitely not bad. Mm, I kind of like it like this. Do we have enough? 13, 6, 7, 2, 7, 8. Uh, we have energy collectors that are still over it. So that's quite nice. Let's save. And these will automatically upgrade. These are resort bases. We have energy bases, defensive bases. Mm. Our defensive bases at the moment are a joke. Wouldn't you agree? Like, like, we have more on our space stations than on our defensive bases. And I'm kind of leaning towards getting rid of a few. It, 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 it doesn't cost us as much. But we got six and our bases are going to be a lot stronger than these. Oh, well, we might as well just uh, save them, right? So, let's go to stations. Where are you again? Spaceports, there you go. So all of these are large and we're going to be retrofitting you to the Mark 7 design. There we go. That all is going to be changing. That will definitely boost our power projection. And let's go towards a, a defensive base. And we're going to be copying as new a monitoring 
Where is that? I've never made a monitoring base before. Monitoring station. Long range scanning component. Do I have those? I don't even think I have them. I can't make what I don't have. Let's see, command center, combat targeting system, that's already on there, countermeasures, it is, is countermeasures not on here? Oh, there you go, yeah, we do. I don't have long range scanner components. So even if I would like to make these bases, like suggested in the comment section, I cannot. Let's see, live, basic colonization, hyperdrives, we don't need on them. Resource scanning. What I don't have on them is many fighter base. <clears throat> yeah, can't make these. I cannot make monitoring stations due to me not having monitoring at all. I'm not even sure where they're in. Uh, but I'm guessing they should be in this part, like targeting. Fleet targeting, advanced targeting. Uh, situational awareness. No, wait, here it is. Long range scanners. Don't have them. No, guys, can't make them. Resource exploration. And there you go, proximity, proximity uh, sensors. Okay, maybe just get rid of these two. Like, go for open trade. And let us start going into proximity. Long range scanners. Of sen uh, sen uh, yeah, scanners it is. Don't need to ha go for these for now. I would like to go more in colonization. And colonize the heck out of everything. They're not too expensive. Well, they are expensive compared to the others. They're like 7 million. It's all the way up here. And I think we might want to focus a tiny bit on smaller technology. Compensation fuel, we can't make those. Hmm. Well, we'll see later. I don't want to queue up too many again. Otherwise, I will be queuing my entire episode. And that is not what we like. So, let us go keep the game running. We were checking out our taxation. And this, I do not understand. I think it is the, uh, they are angry with us. But why? Why so much? Our colony has a very high level of development. I love that. I truly do. But 60% and they are way too happy still. Let's go to 80. I want to see this, uh, this go. Go down like an idiot. 24. There we go. 24. I'm, I'm okay with that. Uh, meaning we can most likely get you to 40. I don't want everything over 30. I think that's a waste. Uh, let's go 30 as well. And we want to min-max this because I would really like to have money. A lot. I want to be boosting my research a lot more than I've been doing. Okay, 30 is a bit too much there. Let's, let's go to 20. By the looks of things, they are still happy. Yeah, that's that's good enough. There we go. 93 are, we're making right now. And I've been told to, well, make my fleet larger again. Because this is not working out. So we have a general. And I'm going to be getting the fifth fleet in with the first and the second fleet will get these uh, other three fleets in there so i want to select this fleet actually i need to do that here right so military ships 
So the second fleet, and I'm going to be doing all of them. Onwards to the fourth. To the second fleet. And the fifth is going in with the first fleet. There we go. So that would change a lot. So if we now go to... Um, it spreads. Go to the event location. Okay, that's great. But how do I fix this? Is there a building that I need to be placing? That That's a spaceport. Planetary facility. An armored factory. New wonder. We don't have wonders. Which is, I think, a mistake. Yeah, this, this is what I like more. This, this firepower. And this one is actually insane. Like 7,000. I want you to go uh, refuel and repair. I think they're actually doing that. Refuel and repair. Go. Okay, you level up. That is quite nice. Three year cycle has been uh, has been done. Uh, what we want over here is we want a fleet in here, and I'm saying thinking, let us do the second fleet. We're going to be assigning you to this colony. Over there. So he now has ba he's based over here, and it will definitely be a defending base. And, and it's strong, it's 7,000. And looking at the strength, it's almost as strong as their entire thing. Oh, wow. Treaty and offer. Let's accept that. Is there anything else that I neglected to... Uh, the ambassador is still over here. Oh, fine, let him, uh, let him stay there. Is there anything else? Apart from pirates. We, we don't care about pirates. <laughs> I hate pirates. Oh, they cost me an arm and a leg and I don't like it. Pirates offer discovery. I'm not even bothering to check it. Just go away. Mm. Occupation fleet. Load up troops. Now, this will most likely change... Because I think they're still over here, right? This should... Yeah, how do we deal with this? Infection. So, I'm sure there is... A help option. Um, planets. Government games... Ships and bases? No. I wish there was a actual genuine search option. Uh, I will definitely be asking that in the Discord community. And I'm sure some of them will know how to deal with that. Construction ship has been attacked. So you're building up. Mm, spaceports are being changed. We have so many construction ships. We've got way too many. Exploration ships, we have a, a massive amount of them as well. Can we build a colony ship for that? And I would like to go... It's close. Can we actually build a colony ship for this? They have no facilities, but... They have a few troops. I'll, I'll try to colonize, and we'll see what will happen. There are a few more planets here. Let's go to... Our resource. That's not what I want. Go away. Here you go, open expansion planner, potential colonies. Let's go with distance. So the size is not too bad. And we can actually still send a ship to colonize and we're going to be doing that. 
We're going to be colonizing a lot more. Uh, yep, yeah, let's do that one as well. Not the biggest one. This quality absolutely is horrible. This one is not so good, but it has population on it. Mm. The size is only 25. Well, I have smaller planets, so I should not be worried about that. And there is a citadel on here. Sure, go ahead and we'll colonize a lot of it. Okay, five more planets. That would help. That means also five more spaceports and we got a, a lot of money coming in right now. Can we go and rush you? No, we cannot. How about... Accelerate it uh, uh, like this. Yes, we can. Okay, so this gives us a wonder that's already been built which is quite annoying and i should have done this this brings in so much money robotic defense manufactures robotic troops at a colony robotic troops are not especially strong but they are manufactured quickly and have a third of the normal maintenance cost not sure if i'm going for that let's go with damage control and I would really like to go at better reactors. This is just a upgrade. Let's go with that. Do we have locations that we have not yet worked with? A 28 bonus on high tech. Mm, I kind of want to do that. The bonus is quite nice. And I'm thinking I'm falling behind in certain technology bits. Okay, so these guys are having the deadly plague as well. You have no money at all, right? How strong are these guys in comparison to us? That is what I would like to know. Yeah, you're, you're strong. And these guys are out of our league at the moment. We, we can build up our fleets a lot more. I don't, just don't want to have smaller ships. And there's definitely a, a difference between these two. They are not being repaired and refueled and I would really like them to do it and it just takes them forever which is quite annoying also what I should be building maybe in the future is resupply ships I'm not sure if that is going to be as handy as I'm thinking it is Once our fleets are done, I would really like to start moving on, on this system over here. By the looks of it, there are two habitable planets. And there's one over here. So if we could take all of this, we'll, we'll take the rest later. It's all fine. But I would really like to break the, their alliances. And I believe they have alliances. Yeah, they're, they're trading something with us, but... Get a friendly with them. If we move fast enough, because the soul is the, the strongest in there, even though it has the, the, the smallest amount of territory. What I don't like is this system over here. This is just a forward base of operations. I just don't like that at all. So we have a new colony. Abandoned ship. Let's investigate. Um, as you board the team, apparently approach the engineer attacking us. The pirates. Okay, so they're being attacked. Which is annoying. 
Oh well, what can you do? Darren Pry, Debris Field. Oh. Oh, that's you. Okay, that's great. So, why does this take so long? They ran out of energy. Let's go to the fleet. I think the main issue is they are everywhere. They're spread out everywhere. Where are you? Oh well. I guess we'll just have to wait for a, for a brief moment. Get more uh, research done. Hmm. Achievements. Let's see. So we have 33, 331,000 points. Hmm. Uh, come on. So, by the looks of things, there are... He's close. There are only two that have more achievements than us. And we definitely have the largest population. We do not have the largest territory. And our economy is not the largest either. Uh, but that will change once we start taking out all of these smaller factions. Maybe we can vassalize... One of these smaller guys. Like, you're my friend, right? But you're definitely not strong. Mm. Can we not... I wish there was an option that I could just say, you know, let you are going to be a vessel under me, but I think I can only do that with war. Man, the disease is quite annoying. Okay, let's make sure we go to plus four again. Since we are waiting, I want these fleets back in full power. There are troops, apparently, on... Our first fleet. I don't like that. I don't like troops on my fleets. What ship has troop compartments? No. These. Let's see. No. No. The destroyer maybe? No, they don't. Oh, it could be the cruisers. Yes, there we go. 130. I do not like that. Mm. Get rid of you. Um, is my game still going well? Why can I not change? Oh yeah, I need to do manually upgrade. And get rid of... This. Consider editing it. No. No thank you. It is fine. What I could consider is adding seven more armor. There you go. I think this is way better. I don't like to go with troops on these ships. They're not designed to be troop transports. Uh, these carriers. Nothing which is I like it. The carriers, um, nothing as well. Okay, so it's only the cruisers that had the troop transports. What is your problem? Can you move? One is damaged. And I thought that if they were red like this, 
go to ship, they would not be able to refuel or repair. Repairing ads, so he's definitely going to be repairing. Well, guys, that's it for this time. I hope you're enjoying. Um, pirates secretly funding an attack on the Utopia. Ah, keep that information for ourselves. Completed the research in Accelerated Something. Um, what was I researching again? I don't know. Ah, it, it's probably probably this one. Face intensity. Well, it's fine for now. Anyways, guys, accelerated construction. That is what is finished. So this is a wonder. It's already built. Let's do that before I I I go. Can we still make this? Can can we build it? Um, no. Because this is the button for wonders. And there is nothing that resembles that. So, yeah, we, we basically lost the wonder. Anyways, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope to see you next time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And have a good day. Goodbye.